Hello everyone, this is your boy Troy 3HP, CEO. CEO, yes he is CEO, and I'm his personal assistant, well one of his personal assistants, shout out to Lita, this man needs two of them apparently, he stays busy, um, which is a good thing, it's all about ministry, um, and so I'm Shanae. Yes, um, you know, just let y'all know I have basically all female staff, um, it just didn't happen, you know, it didn't happen way by accident, it's just the uh, females that I have in my staff, basically the ones that just kept grinding, kept But if you think about it, that, that's how churches, if you look at all, most of the churches, all women anyway. <laughs> But it didn't work out for you. No, no, no hating against the brothers out there. Y'all just need to step up. I think it's time. Y'all just need to step up. But not all of them. I mean, I'm not going to bash no, all of them. No, not all of them. But um, the reason that we're here, we basically want to talk about 3HP Nation and things that we're about to do. So um, a lot of people know me. I'm doing a lot, do a lot of stuff in the industry, came from the industry. So, um, you know, I have a lot of clients in the industry. So what I want to do is develop and help the next um, artist, next big things in, in the industry to make global impact and that's what we're about to do so um, it's just show some love because we know a lot of artists out there that got finances and to, to be able to do things so um, if you I haven't the checked gas. the gas <laughs> eight dollars a gas a lot yeah but um, basically that's one thing what 3HPs want to get to because years ago I got so consumed, like when I was a former C C O O of uh, Urban Gospel Alliance. I I got, I got too much involved uh, in um, doing the music industry so much. You basically, I basically forgot about Christ. And I see a lot of artists getting trying to grind in ministry so hard that the God is not in it. But you're doing, you can do kingdom work, and God is not in it. So basically, I want to get back to ministry. And once I started developing, getting closer back into ministry, I see 3HP records start growing, the things that we're doing. So um, so I just want to be able to help artists and share test testimonies about the things that we're doing. Um, we're going to do some conferences out in the DMV area. Shout out to DMV. You know, I'm your boys back. You know, ATL still got mad love for you. Uh, Texas still got some mad love for you, you people out there. So you know it's been been some great years out out there. So right now, God has me and be more doing some things. Um, we we did a, we opened a lounge up in Baltimore and we got one in D.C. It was very successful. I mean, God was in the house. Um, I love the entertainment on on the Tuesday night. On Wednesday night was I, I think we went to a place where ministry and I think um, the artists came together and we, we just build in unity. I think at the end of the night, the fellas didn't want to go home. That's what I like to see. I'm so I don't, sad I missed that. Yeah, <laughs> but you see, the artists get to a place. You see a lot of artists come and perform and then they leave. Mm -hmm. But if you give the artists something that they want to be a part of, you know, we was outside just talking all night, and you know, even the cops wanted to know what was going on because we was all outside partying. It was a Holy Ghost party. But we're gonna <laughs> continue doing a lot of things in, in the industry and in, in, in the area. We want to develop a lot of stuff. So I got a lot of partners and friends that's been doing things. Scott Free, Trey Nine, Urban D. Um, shout out to Marcus uh, up there, King um, Kingdom Choice Awards and uh, Bur Burker Chica Rap Fest. So a lot of the stuff that they're doing, I'm, I'm basically developing, doing some things too. So. Um, and shout out to the Dove Awards for letting bringing me a part of Amen. the family, you know. Amen. And shout out to Source Magazine because they give me an opportunity as a, basically a Christian um, mogul, so called, be able to let, allow me to be a part of their event so we can uh, make some global impact. Gospel Synergy just won Stellar Award. I like to thank, give a shout out to Andre Carter. So um, basically. I just want to get back into ministry. I want to be doing conferences. I want to do community days. I want to, we're going to do a 3HP community cookout we got coming up in June. So anybody in the DMV area, please come out. Bring, bring something. Food. Bring something. Bring, <laughs> bring some food. food. So it's going to be free to the public, but I want to do things in the community. I want to bring the artists out. I want to bring the consumers out. I want to bring the churches out so we can have a good time. Volleyball. We want to, you know, badminton. Oh, you no. Know. Yes, yeah, so, you know, run around, catch, play with, you know, play with the bees. And mm -hmm. <laughs> get stung. <laughs> so um, it's just, just God has really been opening up a lot of doors, and I want to be able to give back. 
because once once you start you start receiving so much, I see a lot a lack a lot of people you know not giving back. So mm -hmm. those are the things that um I see this that that was lacking. So I just basically want to you know be a lead lead on that. See you know phone still going off the hook. So that's that's Big V. That's my girl Big V. Shout out to Big V in the Lennon Club. That's my partner out there. We're gonna be doing some major major concerts. We just had uh. Um, Kelly Price and Trip Lee last month out in DC. So we're gonna continue to keep doing what God's called us to do because God is so good, and we just I just want to give back and want to share. I want to share with people the God what God is doing. So you know, and also we're gonna start a prayer group. We're yes. gonna have a woman's tour and everything. We'll get back to the women. Yes, we get back to the women. So we like get, we get, get forgotten sometimes in the mix. So. so you know, everybody knows I'm about the black queens. Everybody, <laughs> if you look at my Facebook, I'm always giving shout out to our black queens. I'm always giving fellas some inspiration about keeping themselves in check, about loving their woman, and did you tell them they love you and all that kind did of stuff. Did you tell her you love her? Yes, I do all the time. But um, I just want to, I just want everybody to know we want to do. We're gonna start a prayer group. She can tell you more about it. And um, what we're gonna, we just, we just, gonna, I'm just so glad with God, things that God is doing right now, and just want to share with folks. Okay, um, one day I was actually sitting at my job, my full time job, um, and I work at night, and I was like, you know, we really need to pray. Um, a lot of things are being, a lot of things that, um, you know, we go through, um, to seem to hinder. That's with any ministry, not just singing, Audrey, you know, minister, ministers, period, um, pastors, preachers, whatever. Um, we just have a huge, especially here, I know for a fact, in the D.C., Maryland, Virginia area, DMV, um, it's like a stronghold of this religious spirit. And um, I was sitting there thinking, like, we need to pray. I called Troy, and I was just like, we need to have a 3HP prayer um, um, hour where I was thinking, like, to represent the whole 3HP thing. Um, three hours of power. We all know that there's power in prayer. So for three hours, which is three days, one hour each day of those three days, we're going to pick. We're let everybody know. We're just going to stop what you're doing, and we're just going to pray, intercede for each other. We're going to have a getaway where we can get on the phone and um, you know, just just pray in the spirit and intercede for everything that's going on and for all the artists and homes and um, the back and forth backsliding with some people um, just a whole bunch of things and all these different um, demonic spirits too that are going to be that are trying to hold what God is doing because um, it's you know just so much stuff that we have to break through in order to get through so we can get to and you like that you like how I did that she rapping now yeah I'm trying I'm trying Anyway, but um, yes. Um, so the the once I we pray about a um a date, you will see a date, especially if you're on the Three HP um Facebook um page, and then we'll post it also on Three HP Nation dot com when we're gonna start and what time. Um, and we have a number where I can call in. We're gonna pray for that particular hour, and then the next date you'll probably you know get um I would say within a week or two right after that another day and it's gonna keep going on like that and so we just break down these strong so I mean jealousy everything we're gonna pray about everything um and that's the main that was mainly on my heart concerning 3HP Nation because a lot of times we forget that that's the foundation that God gave us prayer to you know to break these strongholds Amen. Amen. So everybody out there, you know, everybody knows 3HP Reverse the Curse is now on 20 stations. Um, but the next week's going to be 22, so we're going to be picking up two more stations. If anybody got any music out there, they want some radio play, of course, we got to play everything that's radio quality, and if it's not mixed and mastered, and, um, you know, so we want things to be excellent. And what so, do you mean by that? Like the, the CD with the marker on it? No, I'm just talking about they sending me MP3. <laughs> oh, so basically you can send it. Well, you can send crying CD. in the background. Yeah. You can't have none can't of that. Have that. We also have if we're we're in if we're gonna do this, we're gonna do it right. We're gonna do it in an excellent. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, if you need help with that, let us know. We will be gladly to help you. I mean, I know Troy knows a lot of people, so just come to us and let us know what you you know. And shout you out need. to DJ Sean Rebel. Yes. Yeah. What's my mixtape? 
So he's the host of um, 3HP Reverse the Curse. Um, you know, we're, we're all over the place right now. So um, we're actually developing our own 24 hour Reverse the Curse radio show coming up. Um, we got the 3HP magazine. So, um, and then. Don't forget June 20th. Can I see some of the magazine 33. that I'm going to be doing? I'm so into um, uplifting women. And um, there was, there's a column that I'm going to be doing actually where each month we're going to, you may hit, I may hit you up out the blue. Hey, you want to be in a column this month? I just want to highlight um, different Christian women that are doing things for the kingdom. And, um, you know, we, sometimes, you know, back in the day, they always felt like, you know, because you're a female, you, you know, couldn't be. No, beautiful. You had you couldn't do this. You couldn't do that. I I'm in, I've done modeling, been in the fashion world. I used to do hair, all that. So you know, and I still love the Lord. So I want to show you know we can still you know be have beautiful on the inside and outside, and still um, impact the kingdom. So that's gonna be a little Kyle I just want to throw out there. Yes. Back to what I was saying about. <laughs> We got the HP magazine. We got some lot of you know the magazine is going to be much different because we want to be able to captivate the world and the church. So we're going to have a lot of former secular artists giving you know giving people reasons why and the kids you know the kids we know why how they give up the bling bling what they can you, do. Can you shout out some names of the secular artists? I'm just curious. No, I don't want to do that right that now. Happen. That was a surprise. Oh yeah. I so like we got three coming on the cover. The first one we got three coming on the cover. Wow. So uh, I want to start it off with a bang because I want to I want to do something a lot of people ain't doing so uh, a, lot, a lot of people know I do got friends in the industry so I just want to make global impact global global impact so um, you know um, we got the th you know got my birthday badge coming up the rooftop in DC so anybody in town give us a hit up at 3HP records at gmail we'll give you so all the details you go to 3HP nation and get the, get the information we got the poster coming soon we'll have a rooftop all white party for my birthday. His birthday wearing out. white yes we're all, we all, <laughs> all wearing white. white I don't like wearing white but I'm going to get him a hat oh my goodness I'm wearing a hat he's going to wear a white hat it's going to be hot I ain't wearing no hat white hat I think he's but um we got that coming up. We got Spring Fest coming up. We got the concerts. A lot of the concerts. We're bringing major concerts out into the D.C. area. Uh, once we start building more, we'll start moving a lot of the concerts to Baltimore. We want to make sure we get the right support in the Baltimore area. Right now, we got a heavy support system in D.C., so I want to bring that over. That's why I'm doing D.C. and Baltimore. But um, we got some other things going on. Let's give a shout out to Source Magazine. Um, again, but um, we got we got the um, Eastern Co Music Conference down there, you know. Um, so it's going to give us an opportunity to go out there and and, and share what God is doing. And um, you know, I know a lot of folks are going out there to see the secular artists, but we want to go out there and give the word. So um, I got like to give thanks to Andre Carter for making it possible for us to go down there. We're getting ready to get prepared for the BET um, awards coming up. Um, for the CDs and submissions and all that kind of stuff. So of course, I can't put all the gospel artists on the, on the CD. So um, we're going to have a couple spots and we'll have, we might do a contest and everything. Um, Soul Train, shout out to Soul Train Music Awards for you know showing 3HP love. Um, but um, like I said, I'm we really I'm really passionate about what God is doing. And uh, shout out to Robinson, one of the founders of. Um, a Yo MTV Raps. We're, about, we're working on some things to do some things in, in in videos and stuff like that. So and um, you know with the Dove Awards, you know and um, Gospel Heritage. Thanks for to um, Teresa Harrison for letting me be allow me to be one of the promoters and a part of the that event in Extra Christian Music Awards with Henry Harris. We got um, Phil Carter's um, Independent Gospel Alliance Conf Music Conference. I'm very excited about that. We got a lot of stuff going on, so we keep going on because I know I'm forgetting a lot, whole lot of stuff because yeah. we're doing stuff we, can, we got a pool party coming pool up party. pool party mm -hmm. so you know we, we don't want anybody coming out there being distracted so we want you know we even hitting the colleges too and that's just next month oh yeah we hit the college, college. too and we got like, the women's tour we're going to show some love to the women yes ladies but um you know but I don't, we want to talk your ear off but we want to keep Keep y'all coming with with things that's going on in the industry and what 3HP Nation's about to do. But I I, I really suggest you join 3HPNation.com. 
so we can help the independent artists. We're gonna break some artists. We're gonna give some artists some opportunities to open up for some major artists. So um, we want, you know, we're gonna do some consulting. Um, shout out to to my girl Talene, former lead singer of Landing Stars. She does a lot of the graphics. One of my partners. Very hard work. Very, very always hard working hard, and she's very obedient. God is just God is just doing things. She's gonna be all over the double wars. Got double wars coming up in um in Atlanta. Got a lot of artists on the event. Um got my boy um Bull Prophet hosting some events. Um so God is really makes making some moves and um and I really love um being obedient because once once you being obedient you see all the blessings be coming down. But um but this is, you know, this. And just also, when you see someone being obedient, it also motivates you to want to follow them, not, you know, and be able to pray for them and uplift them. So that's another reason why I'm going to bring up the prayer issue again, because Troy, being the CEO of Three H P.